Yanks and Red Sox getting set to play two. We're suited up for two. We'll be here all day with you pregame and postgame around each game. And Jack, it feels like to this point, the Yankees and the Red Sox, the way they've played, they've sort of, the Yankees haven't been able to chart their own course. It feels like today, head to head, they can start to do that. Today is a monumental day for the Yankees, Bob, because of what you have just referred to. They've been chasing the Red Sox, it feels like, all season long, and it's been frustrating and exasperating. The Red Sox have won 10 of the 13 meetings between the two teams. But today, the Yankees can take a walk on the wild side because if the Yankees happen to sweep the Boston Red Sox, they will thrust themselves into a tie in that wild card race and they will be able to look at the rest of the season thinking that they are as good as the Red Sox and that they can challenge the Red Sox. It starts with Jordan Montgomery, the pitcher in game one. The Yankees could use him to emulate what Garrett Cole did yesterday against the Angels. And then in these seven inning games, Bob, you want to punch first because this is a late game when you get to the fifth inning. So you want to be the team that scores first.